Are you looking for that last minute Christmas gift? Or are you looking for some new accessories for 2023? Well, stay tuned because I'm going to share with you today my top Amazon accessory faves for 2022. Welcome to the Style Connection. My name is Amanda Hall and today I'm going to take you on a journey through my favorite accessories for 2022. That will include earrings, necklaces, belts, shoes, purses, and even purse straps. So buckle up and let's go for a ride. All right, so we're going to start off with gold accessories. I switch out between gold and silver all the time, and I love mixing it up from day to day, depending on what I'm wearing. And so the first ones I'm going to show you are my gold accessories. I'm actually wearing a few of them today. Well, let's start with earrings. And these earrings were my ride or die most of the year. And they were these gold hoops. They're super lightweight. They're a great size. They have them smaller and bigger, uh, but these are the 40 millimeters. I find that they hold up well and they are very lightweight and go great with multiple outfits. All right, now let's move on to necklaces. And I have quite a few in this category. All right, so let's start off with this beautiful Cuban linked crystal choker. Cuban links were very popular this summer and into fall. They are a big chunky necklace. And as you can see here, this gold one has been worn with multiple different outfits throughout the year for me. Although it is a little newer to my collection, I have started to notice it is tarnishing a little bit on the back, but you wouldn't tell from the front. All right, so the next one is much more dainty, and it is this dainty gold crystal necklace that is a more choker link style. It has several crystals that surround the neckline, and it is this delicate piece that I like to wear by itself or even when I layer. So this was a great find. I have not had any issues with tarnishing or wear problems. All right, so the last of the choker chains are this embellished crystal choker that is just almost like a tennis bracelet for your neck. I use this when I was looking for more special occasion or I needed a smaller piece to layer around. This has had no problems throughout the whole year. It has not tarnished or faded and it is also adjustable, which is what I love about all of these necklaces. So let's move on to some of the longer necklaces that I got this year that I've worn throughout the year. This first one is a Y lariat necklace with a crystal and a crystal drop. This is a great layering necklace as well as a great necklace to wear on its own. What I love about all of these necklaces is that they have adjustable links. By taking in the links or loosening the links, you have an option of how long or how short to actually wear. You will see this gold layering necklace. It comes in two pieces and it has a paperclip chain as well as the initial on it. I love the initial necklaces and bracelets as you have seen, and I have them both in gold and silver, but the silver ones are a little bit different. So this is a great layering piece. Um, it's a two pack and I just love wearing these as individuals or together, wear them. All right, so this next one is actually what I'm wearing right now. And it is a, I would say bolero style necklace. It is movable. It can move up and down. You can use it for different looks. You can take it as high up as a choker or you can even lower it. This is a great 
long necklace that you can adjust and play with with any outfit that you might be wearing. All right, so now let's move on to the rings. And the only gold ring that I've had for any length of time this year was this gold thumb ring that I like to wear. You can wear it on any finger depending on the size and they run multiple sizes. I'm wearing this actually in a size eight. I wear it on my thumb and it is just held up all year long to water, um, I don't wear my jewelry to sleep in, so um, all I can say is about day wear, but it has not tarnished, it has not faded. And the brand that I have a lot of this jewelry from is the brand Pavoy, and they are great and they are highly rated on Amazon. You're gonna see a lot of their silver jewelry coming up. All right, so let's move on to what has, has to be my absolute favorite bracelets of all all year and that is these initial bracelets uh it comes in a four set a four pack so you get all four of these bracelets three stretch and one clasp which is adjustable and it has held up all year long i have switched out between the gold and the silver all year so this is a great affordable piece to pick up to add to your wardrobe for 2023. All right, so now let's move on to my favorite watch band and bezel for this year. And it is this gold cowboy chain with this gold and rhinestone encrusted watch bezel. These are by far my favorites that I have worn all year long between the silver and the gold in both. These have been my staple go-tos with any outfit from casual to dressy. These have been the best and have held up the best all year long. All right, let's move right into the silver accessories. Here you'll see these silver hoops that I have just like the gold. They are 40 millimeter and they have held up all year long and they are lightweight and I would highly recommend them. Okay, you're gonna recognize this next one and that is this Cuban Link Crystal Choker that I have also in silver. I have loved wearing both of the necklaces all year long. This one has held up the best with no fading on the back. Okay, so here comes another one that you've seen in gold and it's this dainty silver crystal choker necklace as well. As you can see, I have a pattern. When I find something I like, I bite it in multiples. Jewelry, belts, purses, and shoes are all fair game. Okay, now let's move on to the little bit longer necklaces. Again, you're going to recognize this necklace. It is a Lariat Y crystal drop in silver. You saw it in the gold and now you see it in the silver. And again, this was just one of my favorite layering pieces um, when I had on my silver jewelry. Great quality, has held up all year long and it is just one of the staples in my wardrobe. Okay, so let's move on to layering necklaces in silver. And again, my favorite layering necklaces are these initial necklaces. And this particular one in silver comes in a three pack and it has the um, infinity circles, the bar, and then the initial necklace. And you will see this other great find I found this year on Amazon is this magnetic clasp. This helps you from keeping your necklaces separated and not getting them all tangled and makes it easy to put on and take off. It comes in both gold and silver. All right, now we are on to the bracelets and you guessed it, I have the initial four stackable bracelets here in silver as well. I just love these initial bracelets and I have worn them consistently all year, almost every single day and have no, have had no issues with tarnishing or anything. 
So I highly recommend these. These would make a great gift for any gal in your life who likes jewelry. All right, so the last thing in the silver accessories are this silver cowboy link watch band and silver encrusted bezel. I just wear this combination all the time. I can't tell enough how fun it is. And the great thing about these two particular watch bands is that they have removable clasps. So you can make this bigger. I have small wrists, so I like the fact that it has removable clasps so I can make it small for my wrist. These are highly rated, highly reviewed, and I just love them. All right, we're about halfway through the journey. And I wanted to ask you a question. What is your favorite accessory? Is it a great pair of earrings? Is it a favorite necklace? Is it a great pair of shoes? I would love for you to leave in the comments below what your favorite accessory was or is for 2022. As always, if you like the content that you are seeing and you would like to see more, I would love for you to hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up all right, so now let's move forward in our journey. All right, so now let's move on to the things that are at your waist. And that is my two favorite belts that I got this year from Amazon. This first set comes in a two pack and it is this silver and gold chain belt. This is great for those dresses that might not have a whole lot of shape or that you just want to add a little something something to and so i have used these on jeans i have used these on dresses and i just love these fun belts i would recommend them highly and then my other favorite belt because it's adjustable just like those silver and gold ones are this grommet gray belt I have a black one, but this gray one is great for adjustable sizing. You get it a little bit bigger and you can use it to um, wear on a mid rise. You can get them to wear on a high rise. You can use them. They can um, expand for holiday eating <laughs> if you need a little assistance in that area. So these two belts have been my absolute favorites for this year, 2022. Okay, so let's move on to our shoulders and my two favorite bags from Amazon this year. All right, so these first two bags I have in brown and black. And the great thing about both of these bags is that they have removable straps. So you can wear it with the strap that comes with it, or you can be like me and switch out your purse straps with this great rhinestone silver purse strap that I found on Amazon. I love to change up the look of my purses and give them a little more fun add a little more boldness to them. So I love using these. All right, so my second purse is this great bucket bag. It has lots of compartments, lots of spots to put things, and it comes with this great um, shorter shoulder strap. But if you're like me and you like to switch things out, I love the fact that this strap is removable. And so I decided to pair it with this great chain link gold purse strap that I found on Amazon. It just clips right into the holes and now I can wear this purse as a crossbody bag, which I just love. So these are my two favorite purses that I have used over and over again in 2022. All right, we are almost at the end of our journey and 
No journey would be complete without shoes. Now, shoes vary from season to season. So there are shoes that I wore in spring and summer. And then there are shoes that I wore this fall and winter. So I'm gonna start with the season we are in and that is with these great black suede calf high boots from Dream Pairs. I wear these all the time. I love how comfortable they are. I am not really a heel girl. These are just the perfect height. And as you can see, I have them in brown and gray. I just love the comfort of these boots. And like I said before, why not have what you like in multiple colors? So the second pair are these lower calf sock booties from Dream Pairs. They are a little bit higher heel, but I have found these to be so comfortable. I have just really fallen in love with this sock booty. It is extremely comfortable. It is extremely flattering. And I love point toe. Now the first pair was not point toe, but these are point toe and they're a little bit higher heel, but they are so comfortable. And guess what? I have them in cream and gray. That's how much I love them and how comfortable they are. All right, so here is my third and final boot, which is also a booty. And this style of booty has been very popular this winter. And I decided to pick these up in these pink suede. They are a higher block heel, which makes them very comfortable. And they have this V cutout. I have so enjoyed wearing these with my longer jeans this year and also pairing them with some of my crop leg jeans this year. All right, so we're going to sneak in one little dressy holiday shoe that you could wear uh, for the next seasons that are coming up if you'd like to. But it's these beautiful pink satin with pearls and a crystal and the slide on. These are so comfortable and they are so pretty. If you don't want pink, they also come in black, which I think I thinking about picking up as well. But these are just beautiful and will add a little something to any holiday outfit that you might wear. All right, so now let's move into spring and summer. My favorite type of shoe for spring and summer is a mule. And I just love that they are so common and popular right now. So we'll start off with this black suede, not detailed slide on mule that I just love. I wore this a lot of the spring and into the summer when I was wearing my black skirts um, and just wanted a flat slide on. Uh, this is what I would wear. All right, the second pair is this navy mule suede with a knot detail. The knot detail has been very popular this fall with these type of mules. I think these are so comfortable and they're so fun and there's so many different ways that you can wear a mule. Now, if you're looking for a more classic mule, I have this suede neutral color. I believe they call it apricot. Um, mule that is just a simple basic slide on that I just wore most of the spring and some of the summer um, with my dresses and with my shorts. These are just a great way to elevate an outfit. All right, so if you're looking for a little bit of bling and a fun mule, then you need to try and it is these great, cute, super fun slide on mules with this big encrusted jewel detail on the front. 
I have them in the pink pattern, but they come in other colors. I just think these are so fun and they just add a little something to whatever outfit you decide to pair these with. And every girl needs a good slide on sneaker. And I have loved these quilted slide ons from Dream Pairs that have carried me through multiple seasons and they come in multiple colors. But what I am showing you here today are the navy. They are they have a cushion insole, so they are super comfy and they are a great, great slide on. All right, so our journey is complete with all of the accessories I just loved in 2022. From the ears, to the neck, to the shoulder, to the feet, to the waist, we have it all covered here. I hope that you will leave in the comments below maybe a piece that you have picked up I would love to know what you were loving accessory wise from Amazon, or if there was a piece that you saw that you might decide to add to your wardrobe. I'd love to hear in the comments below. I hope that you have had a wonderful 2022, and I look forward to all the new accessories and all the new things that we will be adding to our wardrobe in 2023. Don't forget, choose every day to dress with purpose.